Hey guys, uh, we're really excited to finally release two new features we've been working on. The two new features are called Auto Content Syndication and our Unique Generator. Um, so let's go over the Auto Content Syndication first. Basically what's really cool about this Auto Content Syndication is you no longer need to supply your own articles. Now your projects will have articles, um, we can grab articles for your projects in real time so you don't need to supply any articles. You can just jump right in. And the way it works is you can choose where you want to grab your content from. You can content, grab content from web, uh, news outlets, or just upcoming popular trends and trending articles. Um, web and news use keywords to find relevant content. Trends does not use keywords. Trends just finds popular articles. So if you only want relevant content, you would uncheck trends and only use web news or both. But if you're building, let's say, uh, you just want to build up a blog that's got very uh, high quality popular content, you do trends and it's just going to be, it's not going to be niche specific. The keywords uh, don't do anything for trends. So if you're looking for niche relevant articles, you would use web and news. So let's say we're building a site about dog training. Get some articles on dogs, some articles on dog training, how to train your dog. Um, uh, good dog training tips. Okay. And then basically what this is going to do is it's going to either search the web or search a news organization to find articles uh, for each of your posts. And it will use these keywords as the keywords to search for that. Then you can decide, do you want to keep the links in the articles or remove the links? Um, that's totally up to you. And then you could add a citation URL. So basically what that will do is wherever the article is grabbed from that we found, this will add a link back to that article to the bottom of the page. So for those that um, are interested in doing that, you could just add, click that button and each of your submissions will have a link back to the original source and cite that original source. Then you basically just check uh, how many articles you want in your project. Let's say we wanted uh, uh, 10 articles and then we'd select our accounts. Uh, let's say we were just doing WordPress accounts, select our WordPress accounts, and then you are set to create the project. We'll of course fill in a test project, number of days, one day, select your project time, and there you go. You don't need to supply any of your articles, um, and our auto content syndication will go and find those articles for you. Now the second feature that we've added is called our unique generator. Now what our unique generator will do is you can decide for each article to shuffle the paragraphs, shuffle sentences, or spin, or you could choose all three. You could just shuffle sentences and spin. And what this is going to do is you could use this also for your own articles or for our auto content syndication. works with anything. And this is just going to make your content more unique without completely destroying the readability. So you can, um, rather than just spinning, uh, where Google might be able to detect that the article has been spun because the paragraph and sentence structure is the same, now you can shuffle your paragraphs and your sentences and spin. So the article just looks like really unique. And uh, a really cool way to just do some, get your blogs loaded up with good relevant content would be do some auto syndication, uh, shuffle your paragraphs, your sentence and spin, and then add a blurb to add to each article to make it um, look like curated content. And then you'll have some really high quality, relevant content that uh, appears really unique to Google with your blurb. You've got a little um, of your own uh, curation going on within the article. And uh, it's just a really great way to get some quality, unique, niche relevant content. So then you just save the project. And then we'd go to our project statistics. 
You can see our products creating. While that's creating, um, let's take a look at, uh, see if I can find an example. Okay, so this was a test we did with uh, keywords of cats, dogs, um, and I think hamsters maybe. So as you will see, we selected we wanted news articles related to our keyword. So check out how it works. So basically the auto um, content syndication grabbed us an article from a news organization about dogs and then we wanted a citation link so it gave a citation link at the bottom that links back to the regular article which is uh, really cool for people that want that so you could go and just link back to the regular article even when you do curation it's a great way to do curation add some authority links in there Google knows you're curating the content because you're linking back it's just really cool feature here let's see if our project is done creating and there are projects done creating. So we had selected web and news. So you'll see our uh, project creation script is just randomly assigned web and news articles to your project. And that's all you have to do. So uh, as the articles go out, it'll grab an article from news, use one of your keywords to find the article. And uh, that's it. So if you don't Want to bother supplying your own articles anymore? You can just use our auto content syndication and you're up and running very quickly.